way. Anybody out there? Barrett! I think I hear him up ahead. Hey! Here goes. Can anybody and hear me? Push! <laughs> It was us. We did this. No. You can't think like that. Whatever came before, it was Shinra that pulled the trigger today. Am I right? Barrett. Marlene's fine. Huh? Aerith found her. Aerith? Is that the girl they took? Yeah. That's her. Hmm. What the hell's going on? I asked Aerith to find Marlene and take her somewhere safe. And she did? You sure? Hey! Where are you going? How could this happen? I didn't really think that... What the hell is going on? Come on, tell me this isn't happening. I've got a friend in Sector 7. I said, where you going? Aerith's house. It's in the Sector 5 slums. And that's where Marlene is? Where we hope she is. Tell me she is. Give me something to hang on to. Even if she's not, I won't blame you for it, I swear. Who am I kidding? I'd probably try to tear your head off. Tifa, know anything about Ancients? 
I know I've heard of them, at least. They come up in planetology books. Meant to be the original stewards of the planet. Could even commune with it, talk to it and stuff. That must be why the Turks wanted her so badly. Within my veins flows the blood of ancients. This planet is my birthright. <sighs> Failed again, I see. <laughs> but through suffering, you will grow strong. Isn't that what you want? It's nothing. Let's go. Hey, pretty crazy, huh? Can you believe this mess? You doing all right? I am, but I can't say the same about my birds. Poor things are scared half to death. for the folks who lived under their world. It's terrible for everyone. How long do you think it'll be before we put a new plate up? <gasps> Man, I uh. can't believe what I'm seeing here. Don't you worry. They'll be fine. Chocobos are so frightened, they're refusing to move. Damn, how much you had to drink, son? We ain't missing no... Wait, over there. What the hell are they doing here? Their jobs, probably. Mm -hmm. Just focus on seeing Marlene again. Nothing else. Legit paralyzed with fear. I'm serious. Yeah, we ain't gonna get a better chance. Yeah. Hmm? The first thing we need to do is find a place to take her up. Well, this is a fine mess. How bad is it here? Compared to Sector 7, we're doing fine. But that's hardly an accomplishment. Is it true that Sector 7's pretty much destroyed? You guys run into Jesse at the pillar? Yeah. Biggs, too. Let they were both through, in it. pretty bad through. shape. In but seven. Wedge wasn't up there with them. He got out. All right. Come on now. There's no need to be afraid. We're all scared. I've been thinking, y'all. We gotta go find the others. Huh? If we don't look for them, who will? Uh, right. Hey, Cloud. Gonna need your help with it, too. Right. My ears are still ringing from it. This wasn't... 
This is Sector 5, right? So where is this place you said Marlene is? Where I think she is. It's a house on the other side of town. Well, come on then. Pick up the pace. I'm going as fast as you are. I can't even imagine how much it's going to be. Eh? Miss Lars and Marnie following the collapse of the Sector 7 place. First, I lose my shield. Good officials are currently looking for emergency responders. And urgent people are using That's the house. Marlene! Marlene! Where's Marlene? <gasps> Is she here? Barrett! <gasps> She's got short hair. She's cute as a button, with the heart of an angel. She was wearing, uh, pink. She was wearing a She's pink dress today. She's sleeping upstairs. Huh? Oh. I said she's sleeping. Uh, I want to see her too. Come on, let's go look in on her. Keep it down. Don't wake her. Maybe you should join your friend upstairs. Marlene, my baby. Thank God. Shinra has my daughter now. I'm sorry. No, I'm the one who asked her to go get Marlene. We'd only just met, but she was so kind and helpful. I took advantage of her. It's not your fault. It was only a matter of time before she ended up back there. <sighs> Because she's an ancient. Is that it? So she told you about that. She must trust you all a great deal. Yes, Aerith is an ancient. Probably the last one living. She's not my daughter. Not by blood, I mean. If that's what you were wondering. <sighs> About 15 years ago. My husband, he'd been shipped off to fight on the front lines. But then I received a letter saying he'd be home for a bit. So when the day came, I went to the station to meet him. But, he didn't come. I couldn't help fearing the worst, even then. But I told myself his leave must have been postponed, that he'd been delayed. Every day I went, to wait and to pray. And that's how I met her, her and her mother. 
I thought maybe they'd run away from Wall Market, or that they were topsiders fallen on hard times. I'd seen that sort of thing a lot. Take Aerith somewhere safe. Those were her mother's dying words. My husband had been away for so long, and I was lonely. So I convinced myself the safest place for the girl was with me. It took no time at all for her to start feeling like family. She was a real chatterbox. She told me strange stories. Like how she and her mother had escaped from some sort of facility. And how she wasn't sad because her mother had just returned to their planet. Their planet, huh? Yeah, that sounds about right. I didn't understand any of it at the time. When I asked if she meant one in the sky, she said no. This one, right here. I mean... What can you say to that? Mommy, don't be sad. That's what she said to me one day, out of the blue. So I asked her, what's wrong? A man you really, really loved just died. His heart came a long way to say goodbye. But he couldn't stay because he had to return to the planet. I didn't believe her, of course. And then, a few days later, I received a letter saying my husband had been killed in action. Things like that, she'd just know. It was a lot to deal with, but we were happy. <laughs> and then came the <clears throat> knock. You know you're not just any little girl. You're a descendant of the Ancients. I had no idea what he meant, so I said, who are the Ancients? They were the original stewards of the planet, whose boundless knowledge and wisdom shall guide us to the Promised Land. <clears throat> Some believe the Promised Land to be a myth, others an allegory of sorts. But we take the words of the scriptures at face value and believe it to be quite real. Which is why Shinra would like very much for Aerith to help You're us- You're wrong! I'm not an ancient! <sighs> but Aerith, even when you're all alone, don't you hear voices whispering secrets? No, never! <clears throat> but all three of us knew that wasn't true. That man knew exactly who Aerith was, where she'd come from, and what she could do. They knew where she was, but they didn't just take her? Doesn't sound like the Turks I know. She had to come willingly, otherwise it wouldn't work, they said. That's why, even if they did take her away, I'm sure she's still being treated like a guest, and that they'll send her straight back home once they get what they need. I doubt it. You're not planning anything, are you? Don't make things worse than they already are. If I lost her too, I don't know if I could, if I could ever. Just don't. Cloud, maybe she's right about this. Maybe they'll let Aerith go when it's all over. Maybe 
We'd be better off waiting a little while. Let's head back to Sector 7. Got things to take care of. Like checking up on the bar. Yeah. Okay. The main entrance to Sector 7 is buried under rubble now. So how are we supposed to get back inside? Underground passage in the park. Ah, good plan. But how do we get to the park? I know another way to get there. Aerith showed me before. <laughs> this ancient girl knows her stuff. Didn't mean anything by it. There was this rumbling, and then all of a sudden... <sighs> Gunfire at the pillar. And now, breaking news. Midgar is in mourning following the collapse of the Sector 7 place. City officials are currently restricting access to the Is there another explosion? And urging people in neighboring sectors to remain indoors. Just until thinking of all notice. the lives lost. Also, Shinra has announced the establishment of an emergency response team. I feel like I'm in a movie or something. To ascertain the cause of the plate collapse and to determine if any other sectors are currently at risk. Just thinking Officials of all the lives believe lost. That the bombings of Mako reactors one and five may be a contributing People heard factor. gunfire at the pillar. Once again, right? just thinking of all the lives lost. I've, I've seen enough disasters for a lifetime. <laughs> <laughs> My ears are still ringing from it. This wasn't it. The plate. It's really gone. I thought it was a joke. Over there. Let's keep moving. Surprise is there. We have to fight our way through, but it's our only shot. Let's do it right. Hey, no thing. 
Good job. Whatever, man. Let's go. We'll put you in your place. Yeah! What he say? Let's do this. Uh! Get ready. See Get ya. Your ass out of here. <laughs> Come on! That's that. That's the way to do it. Quick and clean. Roger. And then some. I got your number. Switch it up. All right, watch and learn. <laughs> Time Stay. for a serious ass whooping. Ha! Ain't no thing. Let's go. Make a decent team. <laughs> Who would have thought, huh? If this is what you want. No surprises there. Nothing! 
not so fast. You want to come through here, you'll be... To ...provide due compensation. <laughs> you were dead? Oh, shit! <laughs> <laughs> Friends of yours? No. Nope. Let me handle this. Stop lying. We both yeah. way back. Yeah. Fine. <laughs> what? Get down. Yeah. <laughs> Hang in there. Let's do this. Gotcha. We'll call the draw. <laughs> Bring it. <laughs> It's on you. All set. It's on you. Need my help, do you? Don't stop now. Watch this. Keep those gloves up. Sure thing, coach. Keep it up, man. Yeah, you too. Over there! Huh? That a way out? I'm almost afraid to go back. To see it with my own eyes. Tifa. Uh. Come on. Does it look like we can go this way? No. There's monsters everywhere. You remember how we used to play? Still in one piece. Who else made it out? I wish I knew. Sorry. Oh, it's fine. I'm just glad you survived. Gives me hope for the others. Hmm. This is bad. <sighs> we need able-bodied men and women. I don't even know where to start. Damn it! He'll be back in a little bit. This is bad. 